Welcome to the Suzuka 8 Hours 2018. This iconic bike race has been attracting huge crowds, top teams and hero riders for 40 years. 2018 is no different, with Yamaha, Honda and Kawasaki all drafting in superbike stars to try and grab a coveted win. It's an endurance event, it's as much about being in the right place at the right time and not making mistakes as, as being fast really. Going fast for one lap means nothing. It's try to be clean and make no mistakes throughout the race, and that's the most important. I always think after the first hour, what the hell am I doing here? You know, it's like so grueling, physically, mentally. It's an endurance race, but you race it every single lap. There's no relaxing, and it's where the Japanese factors come and flex their guns, so it's important to do well. Now, you may have noticed as you wander around the paddock that that little bee in the corner of the screen features quite a lot here. The big factory teams have thrown a lot of money at the bikes to try and guarantee the honor of winning one of the biggest motorbike races in the world. The private teams are throwing everything they've got at just trying to be giant killers. But in this field, uniquely in Suzuka, nearly half are relying on Bridgestone tires as a safe pair of hands. Success or failure relies almost entirely on the sweet spot where rubber meets asphalt. In the endurance racing, being consistent is so crucial, which is why Bridgestone helping us and working together is, is a vital part of the, of the team for us. For me, the, the, the strongest point is that after one hour you can do still be, be really fast and, and do like nearly the same lap time as, as the first part of the hour. Okay. Katsuyuki is, uh, is incredible, especially with the R1. He is such a fast rider, especially here on Suzuka, he's incredibly fast, but also consistent and that's what we need. Basically, we, he does all the hard work, tests the bike, puts all the, the, the lot of hours in. We just turn up, the bike's working great and we get to ride it, so he really is our anchor as we say and we're really lucky to be joining with him for the Suzuki hours. But a tumble in practice injures their local hero Katsuyuki Nakazuka. Michael and Alex will have to do the whole race between just the two of them. Have you started this race before? No, it's my first time ever. The plan changed a bit, but anyway, it's a, it's a cool experience and uh, we will do our best to, you know, to, to have a good result. Yeah, just uh, stay calm, it's more about riding than running. Yeah, we've, done, we've done the hard work, so now we've just got to enjoy the hard eight hours of riding, but uh, yeah, we're ready and we're looking forward to it. Well, this is it. This is where the riders will stand and run across the track, and then right at the sharp end, this bike should get away cleanly and straight down there and race non-stop for eight hours. Right from the first corner, the battle between Team Green Kawasaki, which started on pole, and the Yamaha factory team is intense and physical. The weather keeps changing, as does the lead of the race. So Leon, this hasn't been a very straightforward Suzuka 8 hours for you and you guys as a team. Talk us through the last few stints. We obviously ran out of fuel, we lost 40 seconds uh, when we were leading as well, which was a shame. Then we got caught out with a pace car, which we lost a little bit more. Then Johnny had his crash. Hopefully, fingers crossed, not over until it's over, but uh, yeah, it'd be nice to salvage a podium for after all the things that's uh, happened to us. As the sun sets in the land of the rising sun, despite being down a rider, it's the Yamaha factory bike that still leads. Well, this is it. From the lead of the race, Alex Lowes brings the bike into the pit. You can see there's no other rider waiting to get on the bike. It's just some fuel. Just over 15 minutes left of the race. Enough fuel to bring him home, hopefully, to a victory. This exhausting last push. Better fuel efficiency means it's now the Red Bull Honda keeping them honest. And the green Kawasaki is not far behind, but finally, it is the Yamaha factory team with Alex Lowe's in the saddle that wins. You did it, you did it again, how do you feel? I'm dead, <laughs> but I'm dead, but I'm so happy. You know, uh, yesterday we knew Katz was out and we had to do it together. And such a difficult eight hour, but I'm so happy, so proud of all the team. You know, they did everything they could, always kept their plan and at the end, we have another win, it's fantastic. That's not rain, that's champagne. The podium's straight up out there. And we're all getting showered in the celebrations at the end of the Suzuka 8 hours. Delicious.
three rival manufacturers, three divergent strategies, three very different rider lineups, but the common factor, all three on Bridgestone tyres. That's the secret to the Suzuka podium.